Are you in need of FIFA 22 coins to improve your squad? Look no further than u7buy.com, offering some of the cheapest coins on the market, whilst being one of the safest and the most reliable websites around in the market today. Make sure as well, if you do go to the website, you use code VIPER at checkout to get yourself a discount. Let's get into the video. What's going on guys, Viper here, and welcome to the second player review of the day, as promised, and one that I'm very, very excited for. Today, we're going to be reviewing Anthony Alanga's Silver Stars card. Now, obviously, Alanga plays for United, and I'm a massive United fan. And Alanga is really coming into his own in the United team. Very young player, but an absolutely brilliant player at the same time. Um, he's an 83-rated squad with uh, one Premier League player and 80 chemistry, so it's quite expensive or quite high on the requirements anyway. Card looked great, though. Um, starting off, he's 5'11". He's got high-medium work rates. He's 4-star, four 4-star. Four 95 pace, 85 dribbling. 82 shooting, 74 passing, and 70 physical. So it's quite a nice card, actually, for a silver one. Um, he's got some great traits as well. I've had a little look at the card because I was just too excited to, you know, review this hit, this card here. Um, I'm going to play him as a striker in the 4 one 2 2 narrow. Obviously, we just reviewed Paul Pogba's flashback as well, so make sure you check that out if you haven't already. But as I said, this looks to be a good card. Actually looks really, really meta. Looking at his traits, he's got the finesse shot trait which means that we're going to be doing a lot of finesses with him. And his stats generally look really, really nice, you know, as I've already gone over. But his in-games are genuinely very nice. Um, starting off with the 95 acceleration and 95 sprint speed. 88 attack positioning, 81 finishing, 86 shot power, 81 long shots, 75 volleys and 70 penalties. Let's not get into that. Uh, he's got 69 vision. He's got 80 crossing, 72 free kick accuracy, 76 uh, short pass, 70 long pass and 76 curve. That's boost up to 99, though, because he's got the finesse shot trait, which is really, really nice. Then, this is where the card gets really interesting, in my opinion. He's got 98 agility with 90 balance. He's got 83 reactions, 82 build control, um, 84 dribbling, and 80 composure. His stats um, regarding defending, you know, the heading accuracy is okay. Jumping is very poor, though. Stamina is okay at 80 for a striker. And he's got 70 strength, which is quite nice as well. I personally think the best chemistry style for this card, I've had a little look at that as well. I think a marksman will be the best for him as a striker. Maybe some of you guys want to play him out wide. I do recommend a dead eye if you're going to play him out wide. But for me, the marksman does great things for him. So, as you can see there, his pace is already really high, so I'm not going to bother touching that. 91 finishing now. He's got 91 shot power. And he's also got 91 long shots. Let me look at the dribbling stats as well. He's boosted on the reactions by 5, taking up to 88. 92 ball control here as well, and 94 dribbling, which is really, really good boosts. And then we get the boost plus 10 to his strength as well, which could be quite nice, um, you know, also if he's able to hold off players. I don't know what his body type is like in game, but he is 5'11", and he should feel rapid as well. He should, his sprint boost should be really nice. Now we've got the marksman on him too. Really excited to use him. Let's get into a game and see how we get on with him. All right, guys, into the game we go over Langer. Let's see how we get on. What team are we facing? Very, very meta team, that one. He's got Corne, Zaha, Mbappe, Ben Cheddar, um, the flashback Neymar. It's a good team, that one. Koza still. I can't believe he's still used. Um, I think Salah was a lot better than him, but yeah, let's go. Let's see how we get on with him. Looking forward to this one a lot. Please be good. I just really, really do just hope he is good. That was a sprint boost straight away, so we've got a sweat on our hands here. Obviously, we've got uh, that De Bruyne in as well, because I actually do really like him. I, and I do genuinely think I am going to do like a full um, Silver Stars team in the future. Go on, Alanga. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I was going for that finesse shot. Top side trap here. Nice, Walker. Anthony Alanga. Oh, Alanga. Oh, good turn. No. Oh, oh my God. Okay. That was some insane dribbling from the boy. Ben, good start from Alanga. I'm going to give the penalty to him, even though he missed against Barra. But let's uh, let's give the penalty to the man. Come on, Anthony, finish it. Don't bottle it. Don't bottle it. Keep that head up of yours. Yeah, yeah. There we go. Look at that. One nil. Anthony Alanga won the penalty. Scored the penalty. Very good start. This guy, I can already tell, is a pretty decent player. So we've got to keep our Keep our head on here. Good stuff. Play. Oh, I thought I could get that through there. 
It's always going to be a tight pass. That's yours, man, Danny. Every day. Thank you. Walker could play. Jorginho. Couldn't manage to play that. I think he's actually playing at Cam. No, he can't be. Let me have a look real quick. He is playing Cam. Let's change that to George Best playing there. In fact, let's just do that. Jorginho at Cam so we can thread the balls through better. Um, we could have played De Bruyne there actually too, but De Bruyne in the uh, the midfield and Bellingham just holding should be good enough for us. Nice, Georgie. On to the other Georgie. Oh, Anthony. Anthony. He feels damn fast. I know he didn't get through there and his sprint boost does feel quite nice too. This is dangerous. Oh, it's a good ball roll from him. It's going to be an equaliser, surely. Oh, he's bottled it so hard. Into Georgie. Into Best. No. Nice, Jude. The Bruyne. Oh, that's a poor pass, that one, isn't it? Once again, it looks like we're playing a big sweat here, though. So, I do need to stay focused. And if I go quiet for a few seconds, I do apologise. That's going to be a goal. Good goal. Good goal, that one. Really nice finish. Okay. One all it is. Into Anthony, though, again. And he's off. Go on, Anthony. Oh, Jesus Christ. Here we go. No, I've readied it. I don't believe it. I've readied it. That was 100% going in from that angle too. Oh, fair play to him not playing that pass. Uh, dangerous again. Nice Maldini. Alanga. Oh my god. Oh my word. That is so unlucky. His sprint boosting is crazy though. Oh, unlucky there on the shot cancel. That was good from him. Poor there though. Jude. Good football. Ah, Jorginho's got to find that really. Jude again. Sprint boost. Cancel. Shot cancel again. Oh, Walker's here. What the hell? Good finesse shot. Oh, it's off the bar, though. It's off the bar. Okay, Alanga is doing a madness, to be fair to him. I just, he's, this guy's actually quite decent at defending. Into Georgie. No, that's not where I've aimed that. That's not where I aimed it in my head, anyway. Oh, I thought I had enough time to get to that. Let me switch to Varane. That's going to be a goal, so it wouldn't let me switch. Oh, good, good goalkeeping there. Yeah, this guy is really, really decent, to be to be honest. Nice, Alanga. Plays it off to Ronaldo. Ronaldo's gone. Ronaldo's got acres here, too. What have we got on? We're actually going to look into Alanga there. That's nice football. Don't fancy that with Walker, though. I sh Do you know what? I should have just gone with Walker there. Alanga again. He's there. Sprint boost. Sprint boost again, please, pal. Oh, good strength. Oh, he's a bit of a joke. He's actually a bit of a joke. Oh, my God. I can't believe I haven't scored there, actually. Oh, this game's getting messy now. Into best. Into Alanga. Alanga with a shot cancel. And that's a goal for Alanga. Two goals for him. He's playing brilliantly. He's very, very uh, snappy and very responsive for a silver card. Um, obviously, as I said, though, in, in the, uh, the last video... Just because they're silver cards doesn't mean they're not good. You know, like I think they've got stats of like 86, 87 rated players. Uh oh, this is dangerous for him. Oh, this is dangerous for him. Oh, unlucky, unlucky. That is his weak foot, to be fair. It was still a good effort. <clears throat> now Langer is actually doing a madness. He actually seems like he has high aggression, though. He doesn't, but that is really, really frustrating. I didn't keep the ball there. Jude, you've got to be getting to that. Oh, my God. What is going on? This game is so messy. On the team press there. A bit dodgy to do that, but hey-ho. Oh, nice. Good goal. That's awful defending from me. But it's 2-2. Two -two. This is a good game of FIFA again. You know, we do like these kind of games that are like this. Both both teams attacking. What on earth is that? It's a ball roll, man. Oh, 
Wow. Nice. What? What is that for? Nice. Never mind. Nice. Never mind. <laughs> oh my god, EA. What is your game? Nice. Right, we've got one last chance. We're going to have to slam this up, though. I mean, that was into Jorginho, but you do you, EA, man. This is one rigged game of fee for this one, boys. Okay. <laughs> Thank God he saved that. What on earth is going on? What on earth is going on? Come on, just take the corner, please, fella. It's surely going to blow up. Yeah, thank you. Right, we're at half time. It's two all. Alanga's got two goals and been generally, generally pretty good. Um, yeah, something's uh, something's not going going well for me because I keep, I keep on tackling and they keep getting the ball back. So, what am I going to do? I'm actually going to do that. I'm going to do that. I think. See if we get a bit more work in there. Obviously, he's really good on over the tops as well. If I can get one play from Jorginho to him, um, with his, he's got a decent body type in game, and he's, he is genuinely quite strong as well. Um, he feels quite quite physical, to be honest. Um, yeah, he's been he's been good in that first half. I, I, issue with him though is his passing is too low. To where I'm not going to trust him as a wide player. So he ha kind of has to play at striker. And obviously, he can't play a one striker formation with this card. He doesn't really have that kind of frame. Um, yeah, it was a good first half from him. Let's see what we can do in this second half. His sprint boost is really clean as well. Look at that. Oh, Ronaldo. Oh, no. De Bruyne. De Bruyne, please score. Oh, my God. I can't I can't get past on a rumor. All right, another good chance here, though. Play it out there. Who's that? Killian. There's a Langer. Oh my word, he is actually so techy. No chance. No, 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 no. Jude, you've got to keep up here, pal. He has to be fair to him. Oh, nice. Good defending, Tierney. Got that out there to Ronaldo. Good chance to break here. Never mind. I don't understand that, guys. Why Why is Mbappe taking up Elanga's space there? Nice, Jude. Go on in. Go on in, Alanga. Go on in, pal. Oh, it's unlucky. It's unlucky. Nice, De Bruyne. Oh, my word. Nice, De Bruyne. That's a Silver Stars card, by the way. Doing a madness. Jorginho, we're going to play that on to Hakimi. Hakimi on the inside. Beautiful play. That's going to be a goal. Just Jorginho. Absolutely brilliant goal there, to be fair. I know it was a bit messy when we got into the box, but really nice goal. So it's 3-2 up. Kind of made by Lang Alanga as well. Alanga had a part to play there as well. I like this card, guys. I actually really like him. There we go. It's 4-2. Alanga with an assist there. Wow. This game's uh, certainly opened up very quickly. We go Ronaldo. Nice. He read that quite well, actually. Easy does it. That's for Rans all day. Thank you. Now Dini into Hakimi. We're just going to drive down here now. He's just offside trap. Langer's there. No. Oh my god. It's unlucky. It's, not, uh, it's just really annoying though because that player lock was meant for a Langer and it just goes somewhere I completely haven't aimed it. Good play though. Good defending there. Oh, that's really not, not nice, though. I'll play. He's got the team press on now. <clears throat> Read like a book. Maldini, nice. Into Georgie. Oh, that's nice. Well played out. And we're away down here with Tierney. He was right about the cutback that entire time. De Bruyne. Off the bar. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Easy does it. Easy does it. Nice, Maldini. Never mind. Nice. Good stuff. Good stuff. Kimi manages to play out of that really well. 
Ronaldo, nice, into Varane. Bang that up the pitch. Well, this guy's got the team press on bad. Alanga. Anthony Alanga. Oh, poor miss there. Poor miss. I did try and green it, but it was still very, very poor in the end. This guy's left. Let's get to the final part of the review. All right, guys. So, review done on Alanga. I really like this card. I would argue that this card is probably the best we've had so far. Very, very quick. Very snappy. Very responsive. Finishing leaves a bit to be desired. But other than that, I do think he's really, really good. Skill moves are nice. Um, he turns very, very quickly. And he is very, very quick. Um, that 95 acceleration sprint speed and having that split the way it is, is perfect. And he really, really does feel quick. Especially coupled in with that agility and balance. His sprint boosts are insane. Um, I really do think it's important to boost up his dribbling stats as well. Just to allow you to do the sprint boost better and to shot cancel quicker. And he generally does feel really, really nice. Um, I don't know if he's able to play as a wide player just due to the fact his vision is 69, even boosted with a dead eye. I just don't think it's really going to be good enough, especially that 76 short pass as well is a bit too low. I look at him as a second striker. That's how he played with him, and he was really good. As I said, sprint boost insane. Finishing, not the best, but also not the worst. You can deal with it. Um, definitely boost that up as well, and he is really, really nice. As you could see from the, the game we did actually play with him, we managed to get a penalty really, really early on. And it's because of his techie dribbling, you know. He's very, very fast on the ball. Um, very quick at turning. Good strength, actually, as well. He feels quite strong in game. He's able to kind of, you know, when he's on the shoulder, and he's able to tussle and get beyond um, the centre-backs, which is really, really good too. Finesse shots were okay. Not the best. Didn't manage to score one with him. Um, but he does have the finesse shot trait. So you can trust his finesse shots. Um, just didn't really get the opportunity to really try them with him because I was playing a bit of a sweaty player. Um, but yeah, he got two goals and one assist in the game, so he is very, very viable, and I do think this is a must-complete SPC. You know, it's only going to cost you like 30, 40k maximum, and he is really, really good in game. So get this one done. This is the best one we've had so far. Um, overall rated for him. Let's go over that real quick. Pace, I'm going to give a 9 out of 10. Feels absolutely rapid. Shooting, I'm going to give a 6.5 out of 10. Not the best, but not the worst. A little bit above average, and the finishing that he's able to uh, do Sorry, not the finishing. The long shots he can do with his finesse shots are really nice too. Passing is going to be, honestly, a 5 out of 10. It isn't actually that bad in-game, but it just isn't very good, just generally, you know. That's why he has to be a striker. Because, you know, in that sense as well, a second striker, even more so, because the passing is just too low. If you play him out wide, you're not going to be able to cross with him. You're not going to be able to do through balls with him. He'd be very much wasted on the wing. Maybe try a dead eye on him if you do want to try him there. I personally don't think he will be good enough out there um, to use him, though. So I do think striker is the best position for him. Dribbling, I'm going to give an 8 out of 10. I really liked his um, turning. He turned really quickly. Shot cancels really clean as well. Um, I do think it's also important to boost these stats where you can as well. That ball control and dribbling stat are just a bit too low. And if you can boost the reactions, good stuff, you know. Maybe a maestro for him, you could argue that too. Um, but I did really like his dribbling. And physical, I'm going to give a 6 out of 10. He does feel relatively strong, as I said, on the shoulder. He's able to hold off defenders, probably because of the marksman. He probably won't be good enough about the marksman to do that, but he is okay there as well. Didn't have any issues with his stamina. That's also good to see. But guys, I'm going to give him an overall rating of an 8 out of 10. I like him a lot. Pretty decent. Um, go and get him completed. He's the cheapest chips. Let's go and get him done. But guys, if you did enjoy today's video, make sure you leave a like on it, subscribe to the channel if you're not already, turn on the bell so you never miss a player review. But guys, this going to be it from me for now, so take care.